Hi, I'm Leo. And this is my little sister, Annie. Hi, hi, hi. And these are my friends, Quincy. And June. Do you like reading stories? Me too! Hey, that sounds like Rocket! I wonder where Rocket is hiding. Can you find Rocket? Yes, there he is! <laughs> Rocket's so silly! Look! Rocket has a story too! It's the story of... The Firebird! Ooh! I've never heard that story before! Rocket, is the Firebird your favourite story? It is his favourite story! I want to hear Rocket's favourite story! Me too! Will you help me read Rocket's favourite story? Great! This is a story about the most magical bird in the whole world, the Firebird. Wow! The Firebird is big and red and can fly just like Rocket. <laughs> no wonder this is Rocket's favourite story. The Firebird lives in Russia and everywhere she goes, she sprinkles music power from her feathers. Her music power brings out the music in everything it touches. Her music power makes the flowers want to sing. And the fountains want to dance. Everyone loves the Firebird and her musical magic. But there's one person in Russia that doesn't like the Firebird's music power. An ogre! Ooh. Can you see the ogre? Yes, there he is! Look, he's using his magic power to stop that flower from singing! <gasps> doesn't like music. How terrible! The ogre Catchai has powerful magic and he's always trying to catch the firebird. Uh-oh! But don't worry, the firebird's magic is too strong for Catchai. Once he tried to catch the firebird with a net, but the firebird sprinkled her music power on the net and it started singing. <laughs> Good plan, Firebird! Another time, Catch I tried to catch the Firebird with a giant mousetrap. But the Firebird sprinkled her music power on it and the mousetrap started dancing. <laughs> <laughs> Bird is my kind of bird. Ah, oh, Rocket really loves the Firebird story, don't you, Rocket? But look, there's more. Yes, the story's not over yet. Today, Cat Shy is trying his trickiest trap yet. He's building a pretend butterfly, and he's making it look sad. Look. Firebird wants to help the butterfly feel better. Uh-oh, she doesn't know that it's a trap. We have to tell Firebird to watch out. Say, watch out, Firebird. Watch out, Firebird. But it's too late. Catch Eye's trap captured the Firebird. <gasps> Catch-Eye puts the cage on top of his secret palace. And he locks it with a special rainbow key. Oh no! Without her music power, all of the happy music in Russia is getting quieter and quieter. Aww! Aww. 
there was only one part of the firebird that Catshy couldn't trap in his cage. One magic feather. But it flew away in the wind. Far, far away. Poor firebird. That's heartbreaking. Look, Rocket wants to try and rescue the firebird. But Rocket, how are we going to rescue her? We'd have to get past Catshy, and he has all kinds of magic to stop us. If only we had some magic of our own. Wait a second, I can hear music. Can you see what's making that music? What is it? magic feather flew all the way to... Rocket! Rocket! The firebird sent her magic feather to you! Now you have the power to save Firebird! And that's not all you've got, Rocket! You've got us! The Little Einsteins! We'll help you! Yes! We'll help you, Rocket! Rocket wants to know if you'll help too. Will you help Rocket rescue the Firebird? Great! We've got a mission. We're going to rescue the Firebird. Let the mission begin! a lot of power. Put your hands on your lap and pat with us. Pat, 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 pat. Faster! Pat, 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 pat. Now raise your arms as high as you can and say, blast off! Blast off! Hold on tight, cause here is such a big and beautiful place. But I don't hear any music. And I don't see any dancing. And I don't hear any singing. Russia needs Firebird to bring back the music. We have to save her. But Katshai took Firebird to his secret palace. How will we find her? Good idea, Rocket. Maybe that magic feather can show us the way. Which way is the feather pointing? Yes, it's pointing over there, into that forest. That means Rocket needs to go through the forest to get to Firebird. Go that way, Rocket. This forest is full of instruments. It's an instrument forest. But the instruments sound so quiet. Hey there, instruments. How come you're so quiet? Oh, that's why you sound so quiet. You need the Firebird's music power. Poor little instruments. Don't worry, instruments. Our friend Rocket is here to rescue the Firebird. He has one of her magic feathers. Look! Rocket is using the feather to give music power to the instruments. <gasps> we have the
instruments can play their music loudly again. Uh-oh, but here comes Catri, the ogre. He's going to use his magic to try and stop rockets. That can't be good. Oh, no! Catri made magic bats! to stop them. Hey, look, the flute knows how to help us. He wants me to play him. Go for it, Quincy. You're a great instrument player. OK, but I'm going to need your help. Hold your flute up by your mouth like me and wiggle your fingers. That's it. Play your flute with me. <laughs> Incredible! We made the magic bats disappear. That was a great idea, Flute. Uh oh! Now Catra is making magic mosquitoes. Come on, let's play the violin to make the mosquitoes disappear. Hold your violin with one hand and use your other hand to bow the strings. Play it with me. Well done! We got rid of the magic mosquitoes. Look out! Here come magic spiders! Use your mallets to play the xylophone with me, like this. We did it! Look, look, look! This time, Cat Chai is making a really big animal. It's a bear! We need to play the trumpet. Hold it up by your mouth and wiggle your fingers to push the valves. That's it! Play your trumpet! You did it! You made the bear vanish! Nothing can stop us now! enough to make them all disappear. If only there was some way to give Quincy extra music power. Oh yes! Rocket, you have the magic feather. Help Rocket sprinkle music power from Firebird's feather onto Quincy. That's it. Shake the feather. We have the feather. I can play the instrument super fast. Get ready, here come the animals. Mosquitoes, play your violin. Spiders, play the xylophone. Bats, play your flute. to play even faster. Violin. Xylophone. Flute. Xylophone. Trumpet. 
with me. Hey, I wonder where all those magic animals went. <laughs> They're chasing catch eye away. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing he's gone. Now Rocket can get through the forest. We're right behind you, Rocket. Thanks for your help, instruments. Rocket can hear something. Who do you think is making that music? The Firebird. Yes. Rocket, we must be getting closer to her. Rocket really wants to save her. Poor Firebird is still locked in that cage. Don't worry, Rocket. We're going to help you find the palace and rescue Firebird. I promise. Blaster! The Firebird's magic feather is pointing that way, towards snowy Siberia. Ooh, Siberia! Rocket, go that way, through Siberia. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> I can hear singing. Can you see who's singing? Yes, it's that little seal in Lake Baikal. Oh, he's so cute. That's a Nupa. The only freshwater seal in the world. But he's singing so quietly. He can't sing loudly anymore. Not without the Firebird's music power. He looks sad. Poor little Nerpa. I wish there was some way we could help him. <gasps> Look, Rocket is going to give him some of the music power. I can hear something. Who does that sound like? Catch eye! You're right, it's the ogre Catch eye. Uh oh, he's using his magic to try and stop Rocket. He's making. a snowstorm! It's getting harder and harder for Rocket to fly. Oh no! Rocket is stuck under that huge pile of snow. He can't fly. Catch I will do anything to keep Rocket from saving the Firebird. Don't worry, Rocket. I can sing a special song that can make the sun come out and melt the snow. Go for it, Annie. If anyone can do it, you can. Hey there, little Nerpa. Are you going to sing with me? Great. Let's sing. Come on, sun. You come out sun today and melt the snow. Yes, melt the snow all away. They did it! Annie and little Nerpa made the sun come. 
come up and melt the snow. But Catchy isn't giving up yet. He's using more magic to stop Rocket. He's making an even bigger snowstorm. Oh no! There's a mountain of snow on top of Rocket. That's awful. How am I going to sing loud enough to melt a mountain of snow? Listen, it sounds like Rocket has an idea. What does Rocket have that can give Annie extra music power? The Firebird's Feather! Yes! Help Rocket shake some of the music power onto Annie. We have the feather, the Firebird Feather right here. Wow! I have music power now. <coughs> Little Nepper and I are going to need your help to melt the mountain of snow. Sit up straight and hold up your microphone. Now use your music power and sing. <gasps> come out sun, oh won't you come out sun today and melt the snow, yes melt the snow all away. It's working! The sun is starting to melt the snow. We need to sing louder. Use your music power to sing louder. Forte! Come out, sun. Oh, won't you come out, sun, today and melt the snow? Yes, melt the snow all away. You're doing it. The mountain is almost melted. Sing even louder. What I call great singing. Rocket is thanking us for getting him out of the snow. And look, Catch I got himself stuck in a pile of snow. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, team. Let's go and help Rocket save the firebird. Thanks for your help, little Nerpa. We made it through Siberia! Yahoo! Great! Rocket can hear something! Who does that sound like? Yes, it's the Firebird! We must be getting closer to the secret palace. That's where Catch Eye is keeping Firebird. Look, the feather is telling us to go that way. That's the village of dancing shapes. Through the village, Rocket. the dancing shapes dancey dancey dance hey the shapes aren't dancing something must be wrong yes look over there the triangle circle and square are trying to dance but they can't do it not without the firebird's music power <laughs> Rocket can help the shapes. He's got the magic feather. We have the feather, the firebird feather right here. Well done, Rocket. Uh-oh, who does that 
sound like? Yes, it's Catchy. He's back to try and stop Rocket. This can't be good. Oh no, Catchy is making a magic soldier. And he's blocking the road so we can't get past. I have an idea. Let's try tiptoeing past the soldier. Us. Let's try running past him. He's still blocking us. Rocket, try flying past the soldier. I cannot believe it! That soldier is doing everything that we do. Wait, I have a plan. I can do a special make you sleepy dance. When the soldier copies my dance, he'll fall fast asleep. June, that's a great idea. But I'm going to need your help. Will you help me teach the soldier a make you sleepy dance? Great! Now, to do a make you sleepy dance, we have to stand up. So go ahead, stand up. Make yourself nice and tall, like me. Excellent posture. We're ready to do the make you sleepy dance. Start by rocking your arms side to side, like this. Rock side to side with me. Rocking side to side. Look, the soldier is copying June's sleepy dance. He's getting sleepy. Now let's make the soldier do a jump. So, Tay, can you do a jump like me? So, Tay. Good. Saute up and down. Look, the soldier did a saute too. He's getting more tired. Now, to make the soldier really sleepy, let's do arabesques. Try stretching all the way to one side, like this. Now, try stretching all the way to the other side. That's it! Arabesque! Arabesque! It worked! Our Make You Sleepy dance made the soldier go to sleep. Now that's what I call great dancing! soldiers fall asleep. There must be something we can do. Is there anything we can use to give June extra dancing power? The firebird's feather. Good idea. Shake the music power on June. <gasps> we have the feather. Soldiers, stand up on your feet and get ready to use your music power. Rock your arms side to side. Rocking side to side. Now jump. So 
Tay. So Tay up and down. Now stretch all the way to one side. Then the other side. Arabesque. Arabesque. It's working. Our dance made those soldiers fall asleep. Even more soldiers. We need to dance faster this time. Ready? Rocking side to side. So take up and down. Arabesque. Arabesque. Fantastic. Rocking side to side, so take up and down. Arabesque, arabesque. We did it. We used our music power to dance a hundred soldiers to sleep. Very good, June. That was amazing. And look what's happened to Cat Chai. Did Cat Chai fall asleep too? Yes! June's Make You Sleepy dance either made Cat Chai go to sleep. Thanks for dancing with us. Right, Rocket. We should be quiet. sit down in Rocket so that he can take us quietly past the sleeping soldiers. Rocket can hear the firebird. Can you see the firebird? Shy secret palace. Well done, Rocket. But the firebird singing keeps getting quieter and quieter. Poor firebird. Her music is going away. If she stays in the cage much longer, she's going to lose her music power forever. Right, Rocket. We need to get to Firebird super fast. Will you help me to fly Rocket super fast? Great! Super fast! Super fast! <laughs> to get to super fast, we have to start at Adagio. Pat the beat on your lap. Slowly. Moderato. Now pat the beat on your tummy a little faster.
got to hurry and help Rocket find the key before the last of her music power goes away. I remember what the key looks like. It's a rainbow key. Catch, I must have hidden the key somewhere in there. In his enchanted garden. Ooh, an enchanted garden. Don't worry, team. We'll find it. We've got Rocket and his magic feather. Little Einsteins, follow Rocket! Ooh, it's eerie in here. Everyone, be on the lookout for the rainbow key. Can you see the rainbow key? Yes, it's up in that nest. But look what else is in the nest. An egg. I've never seen an egg like that before. It's exquisite. <gasps> look, look, look. There's something inside the egg. It's... A dragon. Catch, I must have put the dragon there to guard the key. What a mean ogre. Don't worry, team. He's just a little dragon. We can get past him. But look, the dragon is holding something. <gasps> it's a button, just like my button. He's conducting his dragon music to get louder. What happens to the dragon when he conducts his music to get louder? He gets bigger, yes. I cannot believe it. He's a crescendo dragon. This way, team. to the rainbow key. I have an idea. I can conduct a diminuendo to make the dragon's music get softer. That will make him shrink smaller again. Great idea, Leo. But Leo, that crescendo dragon is so big and loud. Rocket knows how to help. He can use the feather to give Leo super conducting power. Help Rocket shake the music power onto Leo. We have the feather, the firebird feather right here. I have the music power. OK, get your button ready. Music to get softer. Diminuendo. Put your hands up really high like this and slowly move them down lower. It's working! The dragon's music is getting quieter. Are we making the dragon get smaller? Great! But the dragon is conducting another crescendo. He's getting bigger again. We have to make his music get even quieter. Put your hands up as high as you can and slowly lower them to the ground. Quieter. Even quieter. Diminuendo. You did it, 
Leo? Now that's what I call great conducting. Thanks for helping me. You're a really good conductor. Look, Rocket's got the rainbow key. Well done, Rocket. Now you can rescue the Firebird. Poor Firebird. Her singing sounds very quiet. We have to get her out of that cage. It's up to you now, Rocket. You're the only one who can fly high enough to open the cage. Oh no! It's Catch Eye! But Rocket doesn't need to worry about him because he has the magic feather. Uh-oh! Something is wrong! No music power is coming out of the feather! <gasps> we used it all up! Rocket shared the music power with all of us and now there's no more music power left for Rocket! Catch Eye is using his magic! And it's his biggest magic yet! Oh no! Catch Eye is putting a magic spell on Rocket! Now he can't fly to save Firebird! But Rocket isn't giving up! He's trying to break the spell! Listen! The Firebird is singing to Rocket! She still has some music power left! And she's giving it to Rocket! We can help too! Let's give Rocket music power so he can break the spell! And save Firebird! I know! I can play the violin to give Rocket music power! Play your violin with me! It's working! He's flying higher! And look! Here come the instruments! Too. I can help too. I can sing to give Rocket music power. And here comes little Nerpa to sing with me. Rocket, I sing my song to you. I sing my song to Rocket. Sing with us.
to say thank you for all of your help. And so does the Firebird. Mission completed! Now it's time for the Curtain Call! Let's give a hand and hear it for the team. Music 